Hey guys, it's me, the Bricks and Mandalore, back with another video. Today we're going to be looking at this Lego Star Wars Imperial Prison Breakout mock. So this mock is a Imperial Prison courtyard area where there are rebel shock troopers breaking out the prisoners and they've taken the officer hostage and are using him as a human shield. This courtyard contains two main pathways, one pathway up here to the door, one pathway across there, and as you can see this wall has various panels on it, with the doorway along here, like the stormtrooper here that died trying to use the security panel there. So they've broken, they have killed the stormtroopers essentially and the officers however the main security officer is this guy and his death troopers were called in by him on his order and these shock troopers consist of Endor troopers the same uniform Cara Dune because she's a shock trooper and this is set around after the battle of Scarif and these are the prisoners they're breaking out. So these guys, this guy in the blue, him, him. And as you can see, this guy's weapon here, that is the weapon used by the Mandalorian with the shock bar, shock part on the end that sort of tases people, which he's using on this death trooper here. This mock also has grass stalk pieces placed around randomly with the figures who have died around it so take a look at the wall it's all very different designs and I might make this a continued series so we'll see what happens after this look at the figures here's the first one it's just the regular death trooper figure Nothing unique about it. It is the prison security guard who has the white cap with the scout trooper legs and torso and a, I think that is the Old Republic soldier's face. And the next figures are the two stormtroopers types I used. So I used, I believe, six of these types which is the newer ones with the new helmet mould and that's pretty much the only different thing about them and then this one which is the old style stormtrooper with the mouthpiece like that so these are some of the rebels I believe we've got around 10 of these on the or actually a bit less than that probably around 6 of these on the mock as they are part of the initial strike force along with these two which are both canonically, I believe they both died in Rogue One. However, we can just pretend that they are someone else. And these are some of the prisoners they were breaking out. So the rebels were specifically breaking out this guy and these two other rebels. However, this guy was probably just one of the other inmates that managed to get out as he is a pirate. Although, you never know, they may join the rebels. So yeah, this figure here, he's got the Sif Trooper torso and legs, one of the old knight helmets, and I believe a uh, face print from Ninjago. This one, he's technically wearing the uniform of a Kamino cloning facility. However, that's not specifically who he is. He is probably a politician, perhaps, and this is sort of the, the clothes they make them wear in the prison. And there's also the Alderaan soldier, or classic rebel, depending on what you would say. And he is probably being held in there after being captured and is being tortured, and they've left him in his uniform. However, they broke him out. And the shock troopers you have already seen, 
These are the other two. So this is Cara Dune from the Mandalorian TV series. As she is an ex shot trooper, this is her while she is fighting. And she's got the same outfit and gun as she does in the Mandalorian sets. And then this next one is probably some sort of elite shock, shock trooper. And he's got this angle grinder sort of thing to help him break into the prison. Hey guys, that's the end of the video. However, I just wanted to say that, yes, I know I don't normally do Star Wars stuff and I sort of stopped doing that around a year ago now, but I have decided that I might go back for a bit. Obviously, I will continue doing World War One and World War Two stuff as that is at its core this channel. And I mean, this channel is named after Star Wars, so I may as well sort of keep it going as I might be doing a stop motion on it to do with Mandalorians. As now that show has been released like properly in the UK and I managed to watch the full thing and I've there's loads of figures being released for it, I will be able to make more sets and stop motions to do with this. Gallipoli, there'll be an update coming out soon. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe for more as I do upload every week and comment down below what you would like to see and how you think about what you think about bringing Star Wars Lego back to the channel. Goodbye.